You know, it's interesting that I, I guess we can get started. The the uh, very quick comment that you had made before about uh, the support that you see in the um, in the spiders and two hundred nine eighty six, I believe you had said. Is that yeah, the fifty day moving average. Yep, and um, I, I think that one thing that some people put way way too much emphasis on is getting it to the exact spot. Um, and actually, I, I had forwarded you an email over the weekend, Mary, and you know, we don't necessarily need to mention a name or anything like that, but I think too many people uh, get too crazy over, you know, no, it's not 210, it's 209.925187. You know, right. we're really looking for an area of support or resistance, especially in today's computerized age. We're not going to find the exact spot. We're looking for areas we expect something to happen, and I think more traders really need to come to grips with that it's not going to be the exact spot right exactly and how often do we say okay here's support here now forget those little wicks that are hanging down there the little tails because they really don't count um, you look for it yeah, right exactly so really support is at 210 yeah technically I guess um, <laughs> 20986 if you want to get it down to the penny Yep. I, no, I, I agree, and and it, and it can actually affect how you're trading if you're waiting for the exact price. You're gonna you're gonna end up never making a trade if you're waiting for the exact, you know, that exact two hundred nine point eight six versus not two ten is the area, and I want to see how it trades around two ten. Right. Right. Exactly. 